I'm adding a few plants to uh, the rock and driftwood category today. Um, the first one is java fern, is what we're looking at here. Uh, there's there's a few different varieties of java fern, three at least, that are common in the aquarium trade. There's just regular java fern, there's java fern narrow, uh, which is this one, and then java fern trident, which is even thinner than this. Um, so I'm selling these uh, on rocks. Um, they're just sort of separated out a little bit, so you know if you don't want to spend uh, twelve ninety nine, thirteen ninety nine, or whatever it is for a full portion of Java fern, and you know you're not sure how it's going to work or or if it'll do well in your tank, you don't want to risk uh, spending all that much. You can you can go for this option here. So it's a little bit of a smaller portion attached to a rock, and it'll probably be around four ninety nine or so. Java fern is a very easy plant for beginners. Very low light plant, so good option there. Second one, I was reading on a forum that that uh, people have had uh, success with uh, Pagostamin Helfry on rocks as well. The root systems of these are pretty small, and I've heard that they attach to rocks well, so I've done sort of the same thing with this plant. Um, I've attached a few off to to, to rocks here, so. Um, again, this is another option if you don't want to spend, if you're not sure, uh, you're not sure you want to spend all that much money on one plant, and this gives you the option to sort of spread out your your buying power to multiple species if you go with something like this. Again, this will be $4.99 or so. So those will be on the site. They should be on the site by the time you're watching this video.